Hey, good evening, guys. Hello, guys. How are you doing, ladies and gentlemen? How good, is you? everything? I'm good, I'm good. Thank you for being here so early, right? That is very responsible. How was your day, Giselle, Jennifer, Carla, Gladys, Eric? What do you do at work today? Very busy. Very busy? Yes. Okay. All right, good, 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 good. And good day? Very, very, very tiring. <laughs> I woke up. Guess guess what time I, I woke up at? I woke up at 3 a.m. Then I went to work at 5.30. And I was there 10 minutes before 6 a.m. And then I had to start working at 7. And I left at 5. And then I had to drive all the way here for over an hour because of the wow. traffic. <laughs> traffic is horrible. It's horrible, horrible, horrible right now. Nowadays, you know. Yeah. All right, but yeah, you know, it is what it is, right? So yeah, I had a, I had a lot, I had a lot of work, and so I was supposed to to study today, but I just came back and slept a little while, you know. <laughs> I was, I'm, I'm really tired, you know. I was really tired. So, anyways. You look about, tired now. I look tired today. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. In your eyes. That's awesome. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. Hey, but you know, that's 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 good, right? It's a good sign. It's a good sign of I don't know what, but it's a good sign. <laughs> I don't know why it was. All right. Um anyways. Do do you like your job? Do you like what you do? Yes. You do? Yes. All right. I like what I do. All right, that is, that's awesome, that's awesome, that's awesome. All right, guys, so we're going to give, well, we're going to get started now. All right, um, thank you for being early, guys. Let me share my presentation. And we are going to talk about something else, okay? All right, um... Share the presentation. There you go, guys. There you go. Okay. So, anyways, let's get started. Okay. So, in today's agenda, we're going to continue with one of the topics um, that we have the agenda, which is, you know, clauses with it and when. All right. So, um, so let me ask you something, right? Let's start with a small warm up. So how do you feel when this happens, guys? Well, what's going on in the picture? Tell me. She's, they are at the movies. Mm -hmm. And yeah. she is talking uh, by the phone. <laughs> on I the feel phone. angry. Okay, so they're at the movies and, and she's talking on the phone. Very, very good. That is correct. Okay. So how do you feel when this happens? Angry. angry you feel angry right very good okay you should feel angry that is great okay all right uh so how would you say the whole expression that's what we're gonna practice today so how I are you feel gonna say angry. i feel angry you feel okay okay so you would say i you know i feel angry when this happens right okay Okay. All right. I feel angry when this happens. Or you can say, you can say something like this, right? You can say, uh, 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 oops, 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 oops. Okay. You can say, I hate it, right? You can say, I hate it when people talk. Talk on uh, talk on the phone while I am at a movie theater, right? I hate it. 
I hate it. Sorry, I hate it when somebody when people talk on the phone while I'm at the um, at a movie theater. Okay, mm -hmm. you can say that. You can say I dislike it or I don't like it. I don't like it. Sorry, I don't like it when. But the question is, guys, why am I not saying I don't like when? Why am I saying I don't like it when? Okay, so that's what we're gonna learn today. Okay. All right. So what other what other um so I how I will, uh, <laughs> how else could you explain or how else would you express your uh you know your 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 how else would you express your negative feeling towards this? What else would you say? Now I gave you an example, right? What would you say? Maybe um, when when that happened, I start complaining. Very good, right? When that happens, you start complaining. All right. Negative. I don't like teacher. All right. I don't like it. Right. So I don't like it when. Very good. Very good. Very good. Right. So, anyways, um. Okay, so that is, you know, a way of, of expressing that you don't like something like this, right? And I got you, Jaime, thank you. All right, so what about this, guys, right? Tell me, right, give me an expression of, of, um, of dislike, you know, about this. It's stressful. Okay, all right, but let's try to, let's try to keep the phrase, you know, I hate it when, I don't like it when. Okay. I dislike it when, I hate it when. How would you say this? What, well, first of all, what's going on here? I hate the air, airport when. is rolling, dismiss. I'm sorry, what, what's going on? Your hair phone uh, are rolling. I, my yeah. my oh the 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 the, the okay the earbuds the, 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 okay or the, or you know the the earphones and you're say you you said rolling mm, yes, okay sir. the verb would be Como enrollado. <laughs> Curly, curly. No, 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 it's curly not, it's not curly. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. no. How, do you, how, how do you, how do you say that, guys? What's that verb? <laughs> Who's that Pokemon? No, what's that verb, guys? <laughs> My headphones. Dan, hello. <laughs> what? Roll up. All right, no. Mm -mm. No, roll no, 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 no. I hate when. All right. The word, guys, the word is entangled. Repeat, entangled. 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 Right? So, okay, so give me, guys, the whole expression with the entangled. word entangled, right? Entangled. 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 I, I sent the, the, um, the spelling to the chat. Oh. I, I hate when my AirPods entangle. Okay. I ha I hate it when my AirPods, Air AirPods, I'm sorry. It's yeah. not AirPods, guys. AirPods are, you know, from Apple, right? I, I don't know if these are AirPods, um, but it's earbuds, right? Repeat, guys, earbuds. Earbuds. All right, earbuds. Or you can say, right, earphones. My headphones. Right. Right. Earbuds or earphones, right? Headphones are these guys. The ones I have are headphones, right? Uh, okay. Yes. Okay. So it's not the same. Okay. Very good, guys. Okay. Um, or how do you feel, right? How do you feel when something like this happens? What's going on here? Um, Salvadorian, right? So, no, that. <laughs> 
So how do you feel about this? The problem is when that the only space you have. The the problem is what? I'm sorry. When when that's the only space in the when this the, the only space, right? I hate I hate people when park but okay I okay but guys remember the expression should be I hate it when I don't like it when I dislike it when right ah, so, all right so let's see I'm, I'm gonna pick people guys because I need, I want everybody to participate guys all right I right. Natalie Alejandra hello how are you good Hi. morning <laughs> good morning <laughs> <laughs> all right so hey um so Nat natalie how would you so how would you say you know how would you express your um how would how would you express that you dislike this um i hate the people when no i hate the people that that can't to parking, but parking. Okay. All right. I hate. I hate it. Why right? when people park in all right wow. in two spaces, right? You can say in two parking spots. Uh, park in two I hate spaces. it when people, you know, park in two parking spots. You can say that. You can say that. You know, that would be. All right, that would be the right expression, correct? Mm -hmm. All right, you can say the word, it annoys me, right? You can say <laughs> it drives me crazy. I hate it. I can't stand it. I, I can't stand it. Sorry. Okay. So repeat, guys. It annoys me. It annoys when, me. When? All right. It annoys so, me when. So <laughs> let's, let's try to use this example, for instance, okay? It annoys me when. People, right, uh, talk inside the movie theater. Repeat, it annoys me when people talk inside the movie theater. It annoys me it when annoys people, me when people talk, inside, talk the movie theater. inside the movie theater. Very good, right? You can say, it drives me crazy when my earphones get entangled. Repeat. It, it drives me crazy. 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 Get entangled. All right. Very good. All right. I hate it when somebody takes two parking spots. Repeat. I hate it when somebody takes two parking spots. I hate it when somebody takes two parking spots. All right. So these are expressions, guys, you know, to show your disagreement towards something. Right. So the structure is like this. Okay. So you can use, right? You can you can use the phrase, right? It annoys me, or I hate it. Okay. But I want you to notice, guys, that hate. Okay. Hate is what we call a transitive verb. Okay. David, what is a transitive verb? Thank you for asking, guys. Thank you for asking what a transitive verb is. So a transitive verb, guys, right? Es un verbo que trabaja para tránsito. No, a transitive verb, well, you can imagine it like that. So, yeah, exactly, right? The one <laughs> responsible for all traffic. Right, anyway, so, so... Sorry. That's okay. So, for example, hate. Okay, let's talk about hate. All right. Hate. I know, I know you're thinking about your ex, right? But don't worry. It's not about your ex. Okay. All right. <laughs> so, anyways, um, so basically, guys, in grammar, we have hey, hold on. How can I make this? I need to make that bigger. Oh, there you go. Okay, there you go. Okay. 
So when we have guys a word such as hate or actually love, right? <clears throat> These are called transitive verbs, okay? Because in grammar, you have something called um, objects. Now, does it, does anybody here, guys, uh, is anybody here, sorry, familiar with the word objects? Repeat, guys, by the way, this is not objects, right? Don't say objects, right? It's, 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 it's more like this, okay? When you see a word, guys, when you see this word, I mean, not, not the word, right? When you see a no, right? That is followed by by a stop consonant, such as ba 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 ba, right? You must, you should pronounce it most of the times as the uh, the ah uh sound, okay? Uh, like like uh, when you go to the doctor, they ask you, hey, open your uh, mouth, say ah, uh, right? Ah, uh, everybody say ah, uh, ah, uh, 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 right? So this is pronounced objects, 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 objects. Very good. Objects. So what is an object, guys? Okay. So an object, guys, is almost the same as, right? Almost the same as a subject. Okay. Subject. Okay, so you have the subject. Subject. And you have the object of the sentence, right? So what's going on here? All right. With certain verbs with verbs such as the ones that we have here, right? For example, love or hate, right? They're called transitive because they transition, they need they need a receiver, okay? They need an object, okay? They need an object when you are referring, when you're not using a noun, guys, you need an object. And an object, guys, can be an object Pronoun. What is an object pronoun, David? Thank you so much for asking, guys. All right. So an object pronoun. I'm kidding, guys. I'm not. <laughs> All right. So an object pronoun, guys. All right. Would be. Hold on. So if the subject pronoun is I, what is this? What is the pronoun that receives the action, guys? Yes. Thank you. You are right. It's me. Right. If the su if the the subject pronoun is you, what is the mm. subject? What is the the object? What is the Your. pronoun that receives the action? You. You. No, it's you. You. Yes, because see, you mm. can say right. You can say, for example, you can say. You can say, I right hate. You, right? I had you say it. you say I love. You cannot say yours, right? I love yours. I mean, you can say I love yours, but it means something else, right? You know, some I don't know what you love from that other person, right? I love you, right? Got it? All right. So, what would be the if you know if the subject, you know, if the subject is um. He. What is the the what is the 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 object pronoun? Him. 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 Right. Very good. Him. Not him. 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 Very him. good. Okay. So on and so forth. Right. I love her. I love them. Okay. So on and so forth. So because guys, because you know these are these um verbs need transition. You need to use an object, okay? Hey, but what if what is the object? Let's let's talk about this, guys. What if the object is not a person? What if the object is I don't know. What if the object is something abstract? You know what abstract ab something abstract is, guys? Something without a form, right? Like an idea. What if what if it is an idea? What if I want to say I hate it, I hate it. All right, exactly, right? It would be, guys, it, right? Okay, so since we don't have, we're not referring to a person or anything else, we're going to say it. So you're going to say, I hate it. I love it. Got it? 
because of the transition. So if you go back to the presentation, okay. All right, so if you know you use the word annoys me, right? You have to place it at the beginning, right? You cannot say I annoy it. No, no, right? It annoys me, right? It annoys me, right? And then you know you're gonna be the object, right? It annoys me when people talk during a movie. Or you can say, I hate it when people talk during a movie. Now, why am I explaining all of this to you? Thank you so much for asking. Because in Spanish, guys, we do not need to add the pronoun, the object pronoun, it, guys. When uh, for situations like this. Okay. So in Spanish, guys. We would say something like, you know, I, hold on, you can say something like, I hate, right, when people talk during a movie. That's that's how you would usually say it, but no, guys, right? If it is a transitive verb, guys, you need the object, okay? Sounds good? Every time you have an, a transitive verb, you are, you're, you are going to need an object if you're going to, um, if you're going to use a predicate. And that's the logic behind it. So if you love it, let's say that we change hate for love, like in real life, right? One minute you love it, you hate them. One minute you love them, right? The other minute you love them, right? So anyway, if we change that for love, guys, then we can say, I love it when people talk during a movie, right? And we're gonna use when, and you're gonna use the rest of the clause. Clear, guys? Clear as vodka Petrov? Hey. No? Or clear as, as a chocolate? Like a rum. Rum rum is clear enough. It's, it's clear enough. Okay. Right. okay. Uh, David. Yes, tell me. Uh, can I say in the first one, I feel annoying when people talk during a movie or not? You mean I feel annoyed? Yes, you can say that. I feel annoyed. Annoyed. Okay. Repeat, I feel annoyed like this. Annoyed. I feel like this. I feel annoyed. When? Yeah, you can say that. Okay. All right. I feel annoyed when people, so then you would be using, you know, talk mm. in the movies, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Very good. Very good. Okay, so... At the movies, actually, not in the movies, because in the movies would be like the movie itself, right? So, anyways, um, good question, good question. Um, all right, any anybody else, guys? Are we good? All right. Yes. Yes, yes. All right, very good. All right, very good, guys. Okay, um, so then, guys, right, let's have some examples here. Okay, for example, right, you can say, I like it, I love it, or I don't mind it, or I don't like it, or I can stand it, or I hate it, okay? So I want you uh to grab your notebook and your pen and you are going to say you're gonna tell me guys things that you don't like you know in situations okay for example um maybe do you have who has a dog here do you have a dog i have a dog all right maybe you know you you want to tell me something that you don't like a situation all right a situation about your dog that you don't like Okay, so for example, you can say, you can say, I like it. Well, let's say something positive, right? I like it when my dog, when I like it when my dog licks me, right? Uh, or you can say, I love it when I hate when my dog climbs on the, climbs on the bed. I what? No. I hate when 
when my dog climbs Fine, on the what? bed. On the bed. <clears throat> okay. On the roof. Gets, okay. When my dog gets in the bed. Okay. Okay. All right. Neutral, right? I don't mind it. I don't mind it. It's like, no me importa, guys. Okay. Mm. I don't mind it when my dog pieces, you know, or pieces around the house, right? Maybe you don't, you don't mind it. I don't like it when, you know, when my dog starts barking at 3 a.m. in the morning, right? Because that means la siwanaba could <laughs> be nearby, okay, nearby, right? All right, anyways, okay, so anyways, so I want you guys to give me examples like this. You don't need to talk about your dog, right? You can talk about any situation, any situation that you feel different, uh, uncomfortable with, okay? Any situation that you feel discomfort, all right? So let's work. I'm going to give you, I'm going to give you three minutes, okay? No, no, I'm, I'm actually going to give you five minutes because you have to complete them all, right? So I want you guys to complete them all. Give me two example, two positive examples, one neutral example, and three negative examples, okay? Of your own experiences. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Right. All right, all right, all right, guys. Let's do it. <clears throat> if you have any questions, guys, please let me know. All right, all right. How are we doing, guys? Almost done? 
All right, all right. Don't worry, right? Keep going. All right. All right, I see that you're still working on it. All right. All right, guys, who finished? Nobody yet? I finished. I finished too. <clears throat> all right, all right, all right. So tell me what's, um, give me one, one, and one, okay? One positive, one neutral, and one negative. Cool. <laughs> Who want to talk first? Yes, give me one positive first. Okay, I, I first. 
One positive. I love it when I can sleep late. I love it when I very good. Good job, right? Neutral. I don't mind it when my cat climbs or climbs on my legs. All right, very good. Very good. I don't like it. Uh, I don't like it when I receive a call with the wrong number. Very good job. Okay. Very good job. I don't like it when I receive unknown calls. Ah. Or yeah, right. Or or calls from with an unknown ID. Unknown. Very good. Good job. Good job. Right. Thank you. All right. Who else finished, guys? I heard somebody else. Me, teacher. All right. Let's tell me. Tell me. Give me your examples, please. I hate. I hate it when my dog don't want it. Uh, next, I love it when my dog is jump. Okay, all right. When, when, when my dog is what? Jump. My no. dog is jump. Hold on, I'm not under. Hold on. Saltar, saltar, brinca. Oh, okay. So I love it when my dog jumps around the house or. Or hops like like this. I love. You can say I love it when my dog jumps around the house. Okay, you can say that. All right, very good. Continue. Yes, thank you. Thank you. That was good. What else? Okay. Good. Only that teacher. All right, thank you, thank you very much. That was awesome, thank you. All right, who is next, guys? Who wants to share theirs? Um, uh, I don't mind. I don't mind when it's raining outside because I like to walk under the rain. All right, very good. What else? Remember one, one, and one, right? Did you have do you have the other two examples? Yes. All right. I like it when people do exercise in the park. Okay. And I don't like I don't like it when someone is unpolite. All right, I don't like it when somebody is Impolite, oh, uh -huh. be impolite. Impolite, yes. Very good, good impolite. job, man. Good job, good job, right? Anybody else, guys? Thank you, thank you, man. Can I, teacher? Yes, yes, please. How many examples? One, one, and one. One positive, one neutral, and one negative. Ah, okay. So, the first one, the, the positive, uh, I love it when my father's uh, my father is watching um, soccer's matches with me. All right, very good. I like it when my father is watching soccer matches with me. All right, very good. All right, what else? And another one. I don't mind it to. I don't mind it when the other people thinks about me. All right. And and. I don't like it when I sleep and they start making noise. Good job. Very good job, man. Very good. Okay. Anybody else, guys? Me, Catherine. Catherine, all right. Let's go, Catherine. Um, I like it when you smile. Um, I don't mind. I don't mind it if you lie more away than me. And I hate it when the people lie. Very good, very good. What was the second example, Catherine? Um, I don't. Uh, I don't mind it if you lie more or if you live more away than me. Okay, so I don't mind it if you live more away than me, like this. Live the vivir. Oh, oh, if you if you uh -huh. live if you live. Uh -huh. Away from me, you mean? If you live if more you live away from, than me, no. If you live more, more, more away. Uh-huh. 
No, no. Uh, more away. No, you cannot say more away. You can say I don't mind it if you live away from me like this. Uh, that would be correct. Yes. Okay. okay. Thank you. Or you can you you can say I don't mind it if you live far or away okay. from me like that. Yes, you can say that. Okay. I don't Thank mind you. it if you live far. Thank you. No, thanks to you, Catherine. All right. Very good. Um, who's next, guys? Me. Um, I love it when it's weekend and I can take naps all afternoon. Very good, right? All afternoon. All afternoon. Uh -huh. Um, I don't mind it when my cat and dog sleep with me. Right, sleep with me. Right. Sleep with me. Sleep with me. Yes. Uh huh. Um, I hate it when my friends use the cell phone while I talk with them. Good, good, good. Thank you. Those are perfect examples, Natalie. All right. Who is next, Des? Who's next? Me, teacher. Go ahead. One. I, li I like it when my wife comes home. I like it when my wife comes home. Okay. Yes. Uh, the next... I like when my daughter smiles. I like it when my daughter smiles, okay. Uh, I don't mind when people talk about me. I don't mind it. I don't mind. Mind it. Mind it. No, mind it. Mind, mind it. it. Yes, there you go. I don't mind it, mind it when people talk about me. Is that right? I don't mind it. When people talk about me. Talk, talk. Talk. About me, all right? Okay. Very good. Okay. Uh, I don't uh, like when you come late. I don't like it. Remember? I don't like it. I don't like it. Like it. Like it. Yes, I don't like it. I don't like it. Mm -hmm. I don't like it when, when you come late. I don't like it when you come late. All right, very good job, very good job, okay? <laughs> all right, very good. Um, all right, next one, guys, next one. Me, did you? Me. All right, so, all right, I think Claudia was first and then Carla. Let's okay. go. Me? Yes, yes Cla Claudia and then Carla. Oh, okay. 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 Um, I like it when I can sleep early. Mm -hmm. Um, I don't mind it when my dog is sleep with me in in my bed. All right, when my dog sleeps with me. Sleeps with my me. bed, huh? Okay. And I don't like it when I when I don't eat my breakfast. Good morning. Very good job. Thank you very much, Claudia. All right, Carlita. Let's go, Carla. Okay. Uh, I love it when my cat play with me. Please. Please. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, I don't mind it when people like to talk about horror movies. Okay. Um, I hate it when people talk too louder. I hate it when people talk too loud. Very good. Very good. Thank you very much, Carla. All right, guys. Anybody else? Thank you, sir. Go ahead. Uh, okay. I like it to listen to music when I sleep. Oh, hold on. Let me, let me help you there, okay? Let me help you because you're saying I like it to listen, no. I like it when, or, well, actually when, right? I like it when, and then you can say, I listen to music. Okay. Right? And then you can okay. say the rest. Okay. I don't like it when to return. Uh, when answering answer the phone. I, I don't like it when answering the home. Mm -hmm. Is that what you said? What does that mean? I the, don't the phone, like the phone. Oh, the phone. I don't like it when 
Why well, you can say when people don't answer the phone. Yes. All right, what else? Thank you, thank you, huh? Okay. Only this. Only that? All right, great job, guys. Okay. Anybody else, guys? Yes, me. Go ahead. I love it when my sisters come to visit me. I can't stand it when people throw garbage on the street. All right, that, that's cold, guys. I Okay. When people litter, see? Litter. When people litter. Hmm. Yes, that, that throwing, you know, throwing trash on the streets, that's littering. That's the mm -hmm. verb litter. Mm -hmm. um, in that case, can I use the verb throw? You can say throw throw trash or drop trash, trash on the street, mm -hmm. but, but no, it's, it's just mm -hmm. when people litter, right? People, well, you need to say this because that's, you know, that's the, the, the way people say, right? Leaders, when people, lead, I mean, when people litter. Mm -hmm. Right, leader. Right, mm -hmm. continue, Jennifer. I'm so sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, and I don't mind it when I have to drive a lot. All right, I don't mind it when you ha when I ha when I have to drive a lot. Okay, that's good. Good for you because I hate it. I hate it when I have to drive <laughs> for a long time. All right, very good. All right, guys. Uh, anybody else? Okay. All right, so next up, guys, we have some practice, okay? So let's make this fun, guys. But before that, are you sure, guys, do we have anybody else who wants to give me their examples? No? All right, so we're going to play something, guys, okay? Um, I want you to talk for a minute without... Actually, no, we're not going to do a minute because we don't have time, okay? How about... How about 15 seconds, okay? We're gonna do 15 seconds, right? Can you talk, guys, for, uh, can you talk for 15 seconds without making mistakes? I'm gonna check your grammar, pronunciation, vocabulary, intonation, and fluence, okay? At the end of the day, you're gonna have a score just for fun, guys, okay? Don't worry if you don't get a high <laughs> score, all right? It's just for fun, okay? All right, uh, but basically, guys, I want everybody to talk for at least 15 minutes without making a mistake. Okay, tell me something, you know, talk about something that you don't like, okay? I'm, I'm right, so talk about something you like or don't like, okay? So you can tell me, you know what, David, I don't like it when people uh, litter on the street because I think that's very irresponsible. One day, you know, I was walking down the street and I saw someone littering right in front of me and I was like, oh my God, what kind of behavior is that? What kind of parents, you know, that person must have had in order to do something like this? All right, so you're going to talk like that for 15 minutes, okay? <laughs> All right? You're going to do it better okay. than me, guys, okay? Better than me, right? All right, so... All right, so let's start with... I'm going to start with people with the cam with their cameras turned off, okay? All right, I... That's the rule, right? If you have your cameras turned off, you're going to be my main participants, all right? So let's go with Eric Cardoza. Hello, Eric. Hello, teacher. All right, Eric, uh, would you like to participate and talk for 15 seconds without making mistakes? Just 15 seconds, okay? 15 segundos sin errores. All right, and I'll give you feedback, right? Yeah, of course. Don't worry. Right, very good. El punto, guys, okay? The point here is that I, I will give you feedback so you can improve, okay? Now, I'm going to ask you something. I'm going to ask mm -hmm. for your permission, okay? Is it okay, guys? Is it okay, okay if I give you feedback here, guys, in front of everybody? Is it okay for you? Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. So if you want to, so if, let's do something. If you want to participate, just raise your hand, okay? If you don't want that, it's okay, right? But this is for, for you. So I'm going to write down the the mistakes, and then I'm going to I'm gonna uh, give them to you, okay? So you can study later and, you know, and, and correct those mistakes, right? So... Let's start then. Um, I'm going to set the timer on my cell phone, guys. So Eric Cardoza, whenever you're ready. Three, two, one. Uh, I'm ready. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go. Eric? Yeah? You can start. 
Ah, y... <laughs> I don't know what, what we are going to do. Okay. You have to talk about, talk about whatever. Uh, talk about something you like or don't like, okay? With you can all right, you can expand on the examples that you gave me before. So you can say, for example, oh, you know what? I don't like it ah, okay. when okay, and then you give me a very long answer about it, okay? So are you ready uh, now? Okay, okay, yeah. All right, <laughs> I don't understand you. Uh, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. So guys, for the rest of you guys, for the rest of you. Try to practice what you are going to talk about on mute, okay? All right. So let's go, Eric Cardoso. Okay. So I don't like when when I talk with other person, the other person talk at uh, the same time that me. And uh, and I love to to see um I I like I love to see the 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 forest. I don't like. Right, very good. I don't good like job. It. Good job. Plus, guys, very good. So we have, all right, only one area of opportunity. Very good. Very good. Good job. And you did a fantastic job. So I'm gonna give you, um, I'm gonna give you one point in grammar out of two, right? So you can only get two points, guys. So I'm gonna give you one one because you made one mistake. Pronunciation was good. Vocabulary good. I mean, 15 seconds, right? Intonation was good, you know, and the frequency was good. Okay, so you got a total score of nine, mm. right? Congratulations. Okay. All right, so you got a total score of nine. Not right? bad. Very good. So now the only thing that we're missing here, remember, we need the object pronoun. I don't like it when. You said I like it when. I, I don't like when. All right. So remember. Okay. To use the object pronoun with the verb such as like. Okay, good job, brother. Good job. All right. Thanks. Who wants to go next, guys? 15 seconds. Nobody? Nobody wants to go next? Don't be shy. Don't be shy, guys. If not, hi, I'm going to pick, guys. Me. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Alexandra. Let's go. Three, two, one, okay. whenever you're ready. Uh, I am ready. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, I love it when I walk uh, on the sun because I can see clearly the clothes. And I love it eat ice cream, but I hate it. Because the ice cream smells. Uh, smells <laughs> Good job. Smells. Stop. Stop. All right. Good job. So Plus for Alexander, okay. guys. Good job. That's it, right? That was 15 seconds, man. Very, 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 very quick. Okay. Right? All right. So very good. So in grammar, I will have to give you 0. 0.5 out of two points, guys. Maximum points is two points, right? So 0. 0.5 is not, not too bad, right? Pronunciation. I'll have to give you one. I'll tell you why soon. Vocabulary. I, I'll give you two here. Intonation. A two, you know, influence it. Also two, right? So you got six, 7.5 out of 10, right? So 7.5. Good job, All right? Very good. All right, so what, what's, what's, the problem? what's the problem here, guys? I can see clearly the class, right? Now, I can see, right? I can see. And then the cloud, the clouds, by the way, this is clouds. Repeat clouds. 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 Okay. Clouds. I can see, and then I can see the clouds, right? Because that clouds, guys, is the object of the sentence. I can see the clouds. And then clearly, right? This is the adverb. The adverb goes after. Okay. I can see the clouds clearly. That's how you were supposed to say it. So the adverb goes before, I mean, at the end, and then clouds, you know, is the object pronoun, which should come after the verb, all right? And then you say, I love it, ice cream. I love ice cream. Now, guys, okay, mm. this, this is a, a good question for everybody, guys. I want you to tell me why can I not say, all right? I want you to tell me why, why I can't say, guys, I love it, ice cream. Why is this incorrect? What do you think? 
Good job, man. I uh, I just want everybody to to understand this part because that that's actually you know my, some some people might think like this, right? Why is this incorrect, guys? Okay. Uh, because I don't do any action. I think it's a lot of it. Eat ice cream. Uh -uh. Oh. I guess it's I love it and ice cream. No, no. oh, okay, right, guys. Okay, now this, this, okay. I, I will explain something to you right now. I'm going to stop the practice right now because it seems that uh, some of you are confused, okay? It's not only one person. So I will clarify something for you, okay? So I love it, ice cream, right? The difference, guys, here between I love it, ice cream, and I love it when is that when guys, when we say when, this is not okay, not a not an object, okay, not an object. This is not an object, okay. This is not an object pronoun. Or not even a pronoun, right? This is it's not it's simply not not an object, right? Remember, what is an object? The object is the receiver of the yeah. action, okay? Now, let me ask you something, guys. When you say it, right, remember, what is the job of a pronoun? Que hace un pronombre, guys? Para que sirve un pronombre? What does a pronoun do? Receive the action. No, no, a pronoun. What of the pronoun in general? Not the object, right? Yes, the object, right, receives the action. But a pronoun, what does a pronoun do, guys? What do we use a pronoun for? To replace mm -hmm. nouns. What do we use it for, guys? <laughs> to replace nouns. Okay, para reemplazar sustantivos. Okay. Now I got a question for you. Ice cream, is this a noun? No. Guys, ice cream, no, it's not a noun, yes. really. Oh. Guys, is ice cream yes. a noun, yes or no? Yes. Yes, okay. Yes. Okay, so here's, here's, okay. So guys, ya tenemos un sustantivo, okay? Se lo estoy explicando en español porque es bien importante que lo entiendan, okay? All right. So we have, uh, we have a noun already, okay? So if we have a noun already, guys, there is no need for a pronoun because a pronoun is supposed to be substituting the noun over here. Does that make sense? It's supposed to be substituting this, All right? So we don't need this over here because this is already it, got it? Mm -hmm. Does that make sense, guys? We already have an object. Yes. Ya tenemos un objeto mm -hmm. gramatical, no necesitamos dos, got it? So, yes. I love ice cream, right? Now, here, guys, here, you need, you know, it. Why? Because love is a transitive verb. So, it needs an object, okay? But since we are not mentioning the, ob the, the noun, since we don't have a noun, we need to use a pronoun, an object pronoun. Does that make sense? Yes. All right? In this sense, guys, you could say, instead of I love it when, you can you could say, I love, you know, and anything else. So here you can use a noun, right? Or you can use an object pronoun, okay? Either or, guys, hold on, or object pronoun, okay? Got it? So that is very important. Yes. The only reason why we use it here is because we didn't have an object pronoun, all right? And that concludes uh, today's lesson, guys. Anyways, uh, did we learn anything new today? Yes. Yes. Right. Yes. Right. Very course, good. Very yes. good. Very good, guys. So again, guys, uh, try your best to complete the platform. I will give you the answers during the classes. Okay. So no worries about that. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna get the answers, but work on it. Okay. Please work on it because that is the most important thing. Uh, I. 
thank you a lot, guys, for joining the class. Every, almost everybody. I think everybody is joining the class every day, right? So keep it up. All right, keep it up. If you have questions, please let me know. And enjoy the rest of your evening, guys. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Thank Goodbye, you. guys. Bye. See you later. Bye. Bye. Bye.